Hello, in this tutorial, I will talk about the uh, character size issue, okay? So, in a uh, traditional uh, load resolution character, the size doesn't matter. But since you are uh, involved with uh, HD or character from different game source, uh, the size really matter, okay? So, what does that mean? For example, if you are making a a uh, full game of same type of character for example this Seba she is from the the sprite is from uh, multi-blood type Lumia if, if you just make a Morgan game only contain type Lumia character you don't have to think about this because all the sprites is at a relative uh, same standard they have come from the same source same game uh, but for Mugen, it's like uh, you can have this character and fight a character from another game, right? So it's really matter when you want to make a new character, okay? For example, we are going to compare our new character Saber versus the uh, Ryu from Street Fighter. And you see, for Kung Fu Man, it's similar to your real, right? But for Saber, she is somewhat too small. It's like um, he is an adult and she is a child. Uh, maybe Saber is a child, <laughs> uh, never grow up. But uh, sometimes I feel like this is too small. Mm. And for example, if I compare with my Mikoto, clearly Mikoto is more bigger, right? Mm. So if uh, your character collection is at a similar size and then you are making a character which is too big or too small and you want to resize, your character and this is a tutorial for you now uh, you need to deeply understand two concepts and two parameters i should say which is local coordinate and uh, and this one and the scale and I will explain these two and you will have a visual understanding what does it mean I will open my Photoshop and first let's understand visually for local corner okay I, I enable this ruler okay I enable this ruler please watch this video under 1080p resolution okay or else you will not able to see the ruler uh, this is a Mugen screenshot and my Mugen settings is from 0 to 1250 which is here is uh, 1280 right and here is 700 and 720 right? so it's 1280 by 720 which is the Which match this local corner okay and this screenshot doesn't include a zoom okay so there's no zoom no zooming no zoom out no scare down no scare up and and you know what this is our sabers uh, sprites right so let me give her another color for example saber outer color and let me cut her off copy and paste you see what it's one by one right it's one by one basically and the local corner is the the full game uh, resolution which is a 720p picture 16 by 9 picture and then you put the sprites into it it 
will be looks like this which is perfectly fine but Mugen is not like that Mugen is you have HD character you have a low D character okay um, let's have a look at this classic low D character which is real this is real sprites you need to magnify it zoom in 500 percent and she will be look like this if only 100 percent it's this big and saber at 100 percent is this big okay so let's same cut in in and this is real and he will be at here right this is real if you change reels uh, local cornet same as saber he will be like this and i can show you so, so you see this is real the local cornet is this one and uh, we want to do an experiment and let's change real local cornet same as saber and make real a hd character and you will see what you see now the local cornet changed the small portrait is like this already this is a big portrait okay okay let's select saber and real let's see is it true they have this kind of relationship on the photoshop is it true Rio is similar here right okay. now you understand this uh, local coordinate what does it mean same as saber for example if we change saber's local coordinate to traditional 320 by 240 here is a picture 320 and 240 and if we put in saber the sprites of saber she will be like this okay she will be like this we can also try that and then we say you don't use local corner so the default value will be 320 by 480 and let's select real as a reference and this is saber wow the big portrait is this big now what will happen and this is what will happen right so if we copy real in this is what happened right so this is local coordinate basically the local coordinate is this frame okay. so in order to make different size the character and play the same game you have to have this kind of local coordinate basically saber for saber move for example 200 pixels 200 pixels is this much but if you ask a real to move 200 pixels 200 pixels from 0 to 200 it's he is already traveling half of the stages 200 pixels but for saber 200 pixel is nothing right so this is local coordinate another thing i want to mention is uh, we choose that this 1280 by 720 local coordinate is because i know this saber sprites fit well in 720b environment if your character for example your character put into this uh 720p environment is way too big maybe it's time for you to consider goes up to 1080p environment i mean 1080p uh, local corner which is 
1920 by 1080 which you can try in Photoshop before you make uh, into Mugen. Okay, after you learn what is local coordinate, and then you are thinking, hmm, I can adjust my character size uh, up and down, big and small, by changing these value, right? Uh, yes, but I don't recommend to do this. Because why? Because uh, uh, if you changing this value, um, your, for example, your portrait, the standard will change. Right? You're changing this value, you, your portrait can no longer using this standard. It will be either too big or too small. So, my suggestion is, uh, you choose your local coordinate first. It's better based on a standard, for example, this kind of number, right? Like this number is a 720p number, right? So also you can use a 1080p number or a 480p number. Doesn't matter as long as a standard number, not a random number, right? Like 484. No, don't use that. You decide roughly how big or roughly how big is your stage, roughly how big is your character, but fine tune the size to match your existing roster. Mm, I highly suggest you use another uh, parameter which is the X scale and Y scale. Okay. By default they are always one. Okay. So the benefit of using these two are uh, you can resize your character up and down, but it will not affect it will not affect the portrait or any background images. For example, the character have a, a background image when she or he doing super. And when you're using this kind of thing, it will be not affect the background images. Or you have a uh, power bar, just like my Dengi Gibunku character, they have a power bar. When you're using these two, you can not affect your power bar, uh, only affect your uh, player. Uh, but using these two are only for a character author. It's not for character collector because you have to decide these two value uh, from very beginning of your uh, the, the, the beginning phase of your creation of your character okay if your character already been finished I don't change these two things it will cause your headache okay. only in the beginning phase of your creation of your character and now we will try to uh, try to make uh, resize or make the saber big or small based on my current existing roster okay. so usually I will pick Ryu as the golden standard okay so let's check now we expecting Saber to be a little bit more bigger right so we change this thing a little bit bigger for example 1.2 1.2 and 1.2 and just try an error so this is the first time you engage a debug key I think you press shift F4 but now it's something is different you feel the saber is bigger than the real, it's it's not right. So maybe 1.1 1 .1. Mm, I think this one is reasonable. Mm, saber is still looks smaller than real but it's kind of reasonable. And let's comp 
pair to my Mikoto. I want them fill the in similar size. Mm, they are at similar size. So I think this 1.1 is good enough. You see, I changed his scale. The portrait is not changed. It's still full size, right? Okay, if you are a uh, experienced Morgan player or uh, developer, you may say, ah, oh, you should not change this value because it will mess up your other things. Uh, for a finished character, yes. Uh, if you change this thing up, all the other helpers, pictures, effects will will be uh, messed up. It will appear at the wrong place. Yes, it is. But you are at the beginning phase of your character's creation. So don't worry. I have a way. I have a very reliable way. You can. Uh, maintain your character and changing these two value okay. if you don't believe you can download my uh, Mikuto, Kurugo or Miyuki and try you change their X scale and Y scale it, they still work fine except the AI of course okay I think this is the end of this tutorial and thanks for watching